Here we are then. Feeling confident? Beat ya. Yeah, sure. How good are you at driving? Um, I only just got the test recently. Do your little legs reach the pedals? Oh, I've got boost seat. <laughs> Karen Carney, former England international with 144 caps, now TV pundit. Laura Wood, sports presenter, Sky Sports, ITV, The Zone, and Talk Sport on the radio. Which one's yours? Shotgun, the blue one. It's like the lightness colours though. Okay, I think we're ready. We're gripping the nation ahead of this summer's big football tournament. So we've got a number of challenges for you guys today, fundamentally focusing on grip. And we're here today at Mercedes-Benz World to actually feel the grip. We've got two identical C63 Mercedes AMGs, one on the latest technology from Continental, Sport Contact 7, and the other car on tyres from, let's just say, the other end of the spectrum. And what I want you to do is to have a feel and see the difference. We have behind us the country's biggest skid pan. There's none larger than that, and this is the, uh, the best place to feel the difference between a tyre that's designed to work properly in slippery conditions and that that can't do the same. Second challenge is what we call target braking. Oh, it means okay. that you've got to be really smooth to get the car off the line and then really accurate with your braking to stop in a yellow version of what you're stood in front of now. Accuracy is not my strong point. Karen just got her driver's licence as well, so she is raring to go. Look up to so look around the skid pan. Yeah. When the back end starts to step out, I'm going to turn into it and try and balance the throttle. Try and keep it going. So more throttle, more angle, less throttle, less angle. A little bit nervous for this one, Phil. We're just here to have a good time. We're here to drift. As long as I'm better than Karen, <laughs> I don't care. I can spin out as much as I want. Shame the car does some banging tunes on the film. I'm not even liking your style, Mom. We're a rally driver! You should have been in rally, your football. You've really not done this before? No, never. Here we go. I'm on a budget tyre. Sorry? <laughs> 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 right, this is like completely... We're in the centre circle. How have we got into the centre circle? It's impossible. <laughs> drift I've done all day. Here we go. Into a spin. <laughs> that was a perfect 360. <laughs> so, you've got an advantage here. You've got the car with the really good tyres. Nick's going to count down and then I want you to accelerate and stop in the box, yeah? Yep. Okay. I'll go as fast as I can. Okay. Uh, yep, you can. Ready? Three. Two, one, go. Where's the box? Where's your box? Where's your box? Where's <laughs> it? In the, oh! in the, in the, in the... <laughs> Where's she gone? <laughs> <laughs> okay. What's in the box back there? No, you're back there. You <laughs> melt. <laughs> We started the day talking about gripping the nation. We spent the morning gripping the C63Ss, trying to highlight the difference between the tyres and the different skills. Karen, how did you feel that you got on on the skid pad? It's really difficult to kind of not skid and spin round, but I actually really enjoyed it. And Laura? Yeah, I don't think I ever really got the hang of it. I actually enjoyed the worst tyres more. So the worst tyres simply lost grip earlier. Great example of why you need good car control to be safe on the road. We then moved to a higher grip environment, our target braking. So these cars are 0 to 60 in <laughs> under four seconds. Do you feel the, the performance? Yeah. The performance? I, didn't, I didn't want to go in the, the, the tyres that were not very good. I wanted that car because you set off faster and obviously then you got a better brake as well. I was the opposite because I was trying to race you and trying to get a best start. And as soon as I moved into the fast car, I was like, oh my God, the power that you get yeah. in Luka is so much better. Both cars are identical. They both make 510 horsepower. It's just that the one with the Sport 7s makes it to the floor and to the ground to give you that push. Yeah, better grip. So hopefully at the end of today, you've got an appreciation of what car control is all about, how we apply that on the road, and why actually it's really important to fit the best tyres you can, because that's vital. But who won? Oh yeah, who won? I couldn't possibly say.